Hey guys, today we're doing a little bit different of a video. I was sent a product by a company called Toner. And this is just uh, like a mini microphone. It's a condenser microphone. And uh, we're gonna check it out and we're gonna just unbox it real quick. So this box doesn't just come with the microphone. It comes with um, the microphone, a shock mount, if you guys can see that, they're kind of dark. Um, it comes with an instruction manual, in case you don't know what you're doing. And it comes with a table mount. So you can just mount this to your desk for like if you want to do quick uh, voiceovers or quick uh, like if you have a podcast or something like that but what i wanted to do with the mic is i wanted to kind of check it out to see and see if there's oh you know what that's not everything <laughs> i didn't finish unboxing it it also comes with a pop filter and an xlr holy cow for i think this is about 60 bucks on amazon i will put a link in the description it is an affiliate link, so if you click on it, I do get paid a small commission. You don't have to, but if you if you want to support the channel and you want this microphone, you can click on it, check it out. Anyway, this is the Toner Condenser Microphone. So what I wanted to do was a whole song, like mic up, other than just vocals, just a voice. I wanted to mic up an acoustic, guitar amps, and bass. I was going to do drums, but I didn't really want to mic a whole drum set with one mic it's kind of a pain in the butt it doesn't really sound i can't get it to sound as good it depends on the mic you use and the technique but i didn't really want to do that so basically what you're going to hear in this video is vocals acoustic guitar electric guitar and bass so here we go let's do it okay guys so the if you're wondering the microphone i mic'd up a 212 cabinet with uh has two celestial greenbacks in it and i'm going through my marshall origin 50 head and i'm using just like an overdrive pedal in front of it and that's it for the bass i am micing this roland bass cube um and i actually had to um pull the microphone back quite a bit because it was just clipping really bad, to, it was just distorting, and so uh, that's how I mic'd up the bass. Downtown, saw you kissing on a clown. Hold the door for me, take a walk with me. You were screaming, you were screaming out loud, out loud.
Hey guys, so for this last part of this video, I wanted to actually talk and do the vo my voice through the mic so you could hear what this sound like just talking. I think a lot of people will buy this mic to podcast with. My final impressions of it are that it's good for voice. It's not good for instruments, maybe some acoustic instruments, uh, but it really did well on vocals unless you scream and then it would clip uh, no matter what you did it's really sensitive uh, guitar and bass electric guitar and bass i had to actually when i edited my song i had to go in and add some more cam cabinet emulation to make it warmer because this thing was so bright and so brittle sounding that i had to do something to make the mic sound better on bass and guitar vocals i almost hardly had to do anything except for add a little bit of compression um, tiny bit of eq but the vocals on for this mic is where it's at so that i think this is a good vocal mic if you're going to be podcasting even if you're going to be doing some um you know like demos as a vocalist it's a good sounding mic uh really easy to work with because i didn't have to eq very much and um that's kind of my review on it uh and i think that's kind of what, they, what this company was going for was this kind of cool like podcasting type mic uh, it looks cool and it sounds good and uh, that's what you're getting so you guys i'll put a link in the description if you want to pick one of these up i think they're only 60 bucks and it comes with this whole whole deal here uh clamps on your desk nice and sturdy uh, it's better i have another one that i bought about a year ago that I just never liked. And I'm glad that, that, that these guys reached out to me and wanted me to do a review on this because I really like the clip uh, or the the boom arm thing on this a lot better. Anyway, maybe I'll use this mic every now and then when I'm doing uh, videos just to get a little bit better audio. And um, yeah, thanks for watching, you guys. Please like and subscribe and hit the bell uh, right there. And we will see you at the next video. Adios.